back to back, like them two intense seasons, like going all the way to the finals, winning it back to back. How was that for you? That was tough for us as a team and our bond. It's easy. I shouldn't say it's easy. Well, I am going to say it's easy. It's easy to win that first that first title. Mm-hmm. Because actually, no one expected Thank us you to. to do it, yeah. You know, so the expectations are very low. But now, when you as a team, as a university, have that pressure to repeat, now everybody knows how you play. Yeah. And and not only do they want to beat you, but they're collaborate, right, collaborating yeah. how to beat you. They sharing notes yeah, and scouting reports is. and stuff. They so. Definitely is. Coach Sharp realized how difficult it was going to be to to repeat. Our biggest issue how was not to was to to lose our humility and to lose our bond and to start thinking that we were better. Certain players were better than than the other. Oh my gosh! Mm. And so I was the most humble person on the team. Until my ego jumped out of my chest and it was a wrap. You couldn't tell me anything. I was, man, if I was James Brown, I'd be wearing that that jet, the coat, and coming into practice, having somebody take it off and then go warm up. It was after the championship. <laughs> After the championship, yeah. so I got a ring. Yeah. My head is that big. Back in the day, we had they called it Jerry Curl. Mom was a wave nouveau. You couldn't wave tell me nouveau. nothing. <laughs> Put that activator in. It was going yeah, down. Talk about how good did it feel when you won the chip? Did when you punted the the ball in the air? Like how how? <laughs> <laughs> okay, for real, for real, guys. I half the stuff that I did on the court, I had no. It wasn't like okay, if I if this happens, I'm gonna do this. Oh, it was <laughs> no. It soon as I first of all, we could have lost the game. Our point guard got picked from behind. The ball heads down the court. It's a layup. It's between Cynthia Cooper and a tech player. Now, you got to understand, Cynthia Cooper and defense (laughs) ain't going to happen. So I'm trailing the whole play, and I see Cooper, and I'm like, man, we're going to go out like this because Cooper ain't going to do nothing. I know Cooper's going to try to block her, like block her shot. Cooper stayed in, stood her ground, took a charge. Took a charge. Took a charge. I grab her. Off the floor, I'm jumping around. It's it, I, and I'm and everybody's like, "Sure, we still have a couple of seconds." I said, "No, Cooper <laughs> took a, a, sure. took a charge. <laughs> <laughs> that's a game. That's a wrap right there." But when that happened, uh, yeah, you. But you couldn't tell us in the second year to repeat was difficult because we had to reel in. Not and I. I'm going to be honest. I, I let my ego jump out of my. You couldn't tell me anything. Number one, you couldn't tell me anything. Then I'm on the Grammys. <laughs> <laughs> with Donna Summer uh-huh. with her hit song She Works Hard for the Money yeah okay so you, I'm on stage <laughs> so Donna Summer's out there you know she's singing I've already gone through rehearsal so me and D I'm calling her D hey D <laughs> she's like who is that <laughs> wave I'm like yeah that's my girl that's my girl we gonna be collaborating on a song after this feeling myself <laughs> so so this is going on. So I got Donna Summer. She sings, she works hard for the money. Mm, 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 so hard for the money. Right? So then my part comes on. So you see two people like they have the rims or holding mm. basketball rims. Yeah. So I come on stage doing my little thing, dribbling in between my legs and all this around my back and da 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 da. And then I go duck on the thing, grab the ball, go duck on the thing. And now she's coming and she's singing the the, the hype. Of the song. Yeah. And then I'm holding the ball. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> so everybody at S, everybody's seen it. You couldn't talk to me for about a month. <laughs> and I met Michael Jackson. <laughs> Where you meet Michael Jackson? At the Grammys. At the Grammys. At the Grammys. He had the glove on. I remember. Oh, is, that the, is that the year he did the one? I walk? met him. I'm telling you. Oh my God. Hey, pretty baby. Oh, man, you Mike. Tell me anything. You can't girl. tell you meet Mike. You can't tell you meet Mike. You can't tell you nothing. Ego, 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 you in you the meet Mike. <laughs> man, if I could have got away with wearing a glove on the court, like Mike, I'd have done it. <laughs> 